testimony about R. Kelly. He's a huge fan. He's bringing me back. I judge because I have daughters. But I judge incorrectly. God is good. I was getting ready to do a video right now. Don't know why. I just said it's going to be an R. Kelly day, Lord. <laughs> brought me back to R. Kelly. But right before I started to record this video, I got only 20 minutes on it. Somebody on Facebook, I mean on YouTube. God is so beautiful. Child says, ma'am, I love you. Ma'am, I love you. You are so special and I love you. I screenshot it and it was sent out. I love you. 111. God is good. God is moving. He wants us to help his children. Let's create heaven on earth. There's a reason why we're still here. God is such as this. When you don't feel that you're doing the Lord's work, but you feel you're doing the right thing, lean not on your own understanding and acknowledge him in all your ways. He will show up. And he will show up. He will confirm his people. Yes. They will confirm it too. They will confirm it too. They will confirm it. Because of Jesus. I did. Yes, we can together. So what they say, it takes a village. Let's help the children. They are the future. They are the future. The enemy is out together. The enemy is out together. This timing is almost up. Enemy's timing is almost up. So he's out to kill, steal, and destroy God's people. That's why parents need to train them in the way that they should go. Find out what the Lord has already put in them. Study your children like you study people. You are the chosen. You are, you are the chosen generation. It's such a big responsibility. For God's kingdom, but you gotta get in alignment and position with Him. Thank you, Lord. I didn't even know I was coming here for this. But He was moving, He's still moving. His spirit is here. Four, four, four. He's pouring out His spirit, His children. His children. It's a spiritual awakening for a reason. He's waking us up. He's waking us up. We have to take back what the enemy has stolen from us. So we have to study for ourselves with fear and trembling. Pick up our crosses. Repent of our sins. 
known and unknown. Because the Lord will bring to the ones to your remembrance when it's time to heal. Enemies have to kill, still to destroy. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and all his righteousness. God wants to heal us all and save his children. They're crying out for help. They're crying out for help. And help isn't even in their own home. And you have to kill, still and destroy even in your own family. They knew it was something about them. And you, the chosen one. Knock, knock, knock on door. Now, Please open up, I can't that's take the Lord. No more. That's the Lord standing at the door and knocking. He says, if you open up the door, he'll come in and meet with you. Baby, go 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 Save the children, help the children, help the children, they need us, they need us, so God has given you a responsibility to care for these children, if he has given you the great responsibility, you must, this is the chosen one, these children that's born today, since the pandemic, many are called, if you are chosen, chosen ones, the ones that's doing the uh, unusual, Bopping for apples at the age of four months. Lifting up their head right when they come out the womb. A couple of minutes. Honking. Saying, Mama, Daddy. I don't even know this song. God is moving. My God. Jesus wants to restore his children. Our Kelly is a messenger. He's a messenger. The Lord. We can choose which way we want to go in the world. He does not give gifts with repentance. He does not give gifts with repentance. So we choose to use it worldly. We can. We can. We're still going to serve his people. But when you serve the enemy, you have to kill, still and destroy. It's only a matter of time. He gets to pull you down and sin. Your greatest sin. That's the one that's going to take you out. But it's never too late. It's not too late. It's not, not late for any of us. We still have breath in our body. Jesus is here to save. He's here to save. He's, help the, he's here to help the sick. So I, didn't come to, I didn't come to condemn the world. I came to save. To save. You're sick. You got sick children out there. And if you're not sick, you've been healed. If you're not casting any more stones, you've been healed. You've been washed by the blood. He wants you to go help rescue his sheep that's been lost. He said, I got other sheep that's not of this sheep head. You're healed. You're healed. Now go help rescue them. You need bold leaders. He's raising up. He's raising up new leaders in the body of Christ. Just call on Jesus, like our Kelly said. Remember.